In this video, we'll learn how to interact with the Tableau Online Views. There are different things in the Tableau Online like the projects, workbooks, views and the data sources. So in this video, I'll show you how to work with the different views part. So let us see. Uh, first of all, I've just logged into my online Tableau and I'm, I've clicked on this projects part. So there are two projects in this place. So I'll select the second project, Tutorials Point. That is the project name which is given here. After I select, it says there are three workbooks in my project. That's a bar, bar chart and stacked bar chart, Tableau Online and the India Map. So first thing, I'll select this option as bar chart. Click on this place. There are five views in that particular place. If you see, I've counted from here five different views. So I'll pick up this stacked bar chart, which is given here. Now this stacked bar chart view, if you see, it is nothing but says as these are the different segments which are given and the sales based on that. So you see that these are different categories you can see and the sales are given here. So I can also filter this. It's an interactive view. So if I deselect this technology and if you observe, there are changes done in the view itself. Again, if I deselect this office supplies, only the furniture options will be available. So if I want to save this view, if I like this view, if I want to save it, I can just manage it. Right now, if you see, there's an original view which is given. If I want, I can just write some name and I'll say as furniture sales. I'll type as furniture sales. Okay. And then I can click on this save. So whenever I log in, I don't have to again filter on this and I can see that immediately by just clicking on this place. If I want to come back to the original view, so I've just click on this furniture views. And if you see, there's an original view which is given here. So I'll select this option on this place. If I click on this original view, I'll come back to the original by default view, which will be given where all the categories and the sales will be given as category wise. So this is the original view which is given. Also, you can manage the different views. If you want to delete, modify, edit anything, you again click on this place and you see there's an option given as manage. So there are two views which are created. One is furniture sales and second is custom view, which I've already created. You can just click on this manage. If you want edit, delete or you want, you cannot, you can make it as public or you can make it as private also. So right now I'll just click on this done part itself. Next thing is if you want to get emails notification every now and then if somebody changes this view, so you can also subscribe. So if I click on this subscribe, you can see subscribe to this view or subscribe to this entire workbook. You can select the option daily at 5.30 a.m. in the morning, you'll be getting some emails, anything which I've changed at this place. The email which you'll be getting, the subject will be given as stacked bar chart and you can add some different users. You can see what are the different users in this place. So that is nothing but subscribing part. Also, if you want, you can also edit this view, which is given same like Tableau desktop. You can also modify this simply you have to click on this edit button. If you click on this edit button, you see there's a view which is given. It's same like Tableau desktop, but right now we are working in the browser. If you see, we are working on the Tableau online. Anything if you want, you can still modify here. Suppose if I don't want the category wise, the colors, if you see the legends are about the categories, if I want based on, let's say market, so I'll pick up this market from here and I can put into this place instead of this category, I'll drop it here. And if you see the sections will keep on changing here. So these are the sections, the colors are given based on the market itself. The market already are being given in the different columns or else if I want, I can select this order priority and drop into instead of this marketplace itself. And if you see here, order priority will be distributed. So I can modify this still at this place. Now, after modifying, you can just click on this place as save. After saving, you can close this and come back to the Tableau online view, which will be given there. Click on this drop down, click on this close button here. And you'll be back to this Tableau online after modifications. Now, next is share. If you want to send a link of this particular view to different people via email, you can just click on this share. And this is the embedded code and the link. You can copy the link and you can send it so that every person whom you send will be able to see that particular view. Provided he should have the authentication, like his uh, credentials, like username and the password. So you can share that also. Now also if you want, you can just download this uh, view which is given in the different formats. One is in the image, the data in the MS access cross tab. Also you have this PDF and the Tableau workbook. Whichever method you want, you can just select and download. This will be visible based on the permissions which have been given. If you are given as only different permissions like administrator role or the authentication role, you'll be able to do that. But if you are just a viewer, limitations will be given at this place. Same way, if you want to see this in the full screen, you can select this option and the full screen mode will be given. If you want to come back to the same place, again, I'll just click on this button again. Same way, after adding this, after viewing this information, if you want to give some comments at this place, you can, you can scroll down somewhere at this place, scroll down. And if you see there's a comment box, whatever comment you want, you can add this place. This is 
this is better analysis and you can just click on this post comment so the comment will be added here same way if you want to edit some tags still you can edit the tag so that every person can be able to see that now out of different views if you think this is your favorite view you can just select this option like favorite button here and this should be added to your favorite part itself so it is already added as a favorite if you want to remove from favorite this is the method if you want to add it it would be added so what is the beauty of this favorite button is if you are in any place any view simply you can just click on this favorite button here and whichever is your favorite view favorite workbook or project you can just simply select this option stacked bar chart and you'll be jumping to that particular view itself that's the favorite part itself so i hope you understood how to interact with the tableau online how do you modify it download and post the comments that's all for this video